Hi friends, this is Gail, Fava of Four. Do you believe I'm doing two videos so close together? And I, not counting this one, yesterday I took the last four videos, people who commented, and if you commented on each one, I put three of your names in. Remember I said I do a random drawing, and I was going to ask a question, but I thought that would be awfully hard. I mean, you'd have to depends on when people watch their videos or how quick they are so I just put all the names in here from the last four videos and whoever I pick I'll send you a little goodie package okay I hope that's okay what I wanted to show you before she came to pick it up um, I told you I, or I showed you that baby wall hanging for that shower gift that I made. Well, I added a few things to it, so I wanted to show you before she took it. This thing's probably too close. I don't know. But I added this on the bottom. It just seemed like it needed something to me. Maybe not. I don't know. Okay. And then I put her name here. I got some comments, which I I agreed with that big old thing was too much, so I just put her name here, Faith. And let me see, see the little baby, see the angel. And I did put a little um, coloring to make it a little darker on the flowers, and then I put some. Um, oh, if I remember all these things today, it'll be a miracle. The um, Anyway, that stuff you put on first, and then you can sprinkle some uh, sprinkles or dust or whatever it is they call it. But I love that stuff. So, but I like it with this. I put a little flower in a pen. And, of course, after I did all this, and I asked her in a text, are they religious? And she said, yes. And then yesterday, she says, they're Baptist. And the medal I had on there was Mary. So, I took that off and put that on. And I think I told you all that um, Diana Bacchus, other than that bow that Atelis made, made this bow. Okay, but I put a back on it. Let's see. I made a pocket, which is crooked, but that's okay. The two bows. And then inside I put a little envelope so she could write who it's from. And I put this little frame there for when she's a little older. And I put a little bit of stiffy on here so I help. I love my stiffy. I put that there to make sure it dried standing up. I'll do it later. And then I put this there in a flower. Same thing on this side. And then because this was off center, I put some of these, I don't know what to call them. What you put when you put flowers on. Just decorative stamens or whatever so I just wanted you to see the back I hate to give it up to be honest with you because I like it and it's really I've made a small wall hanging but I've never really made a big one so I think it's loverly I was going to put a few more little animals in there, but I thought that's enough. I start to get carried away. I don't want to put it down, so I just keep going at it. Okay, she'll be here shortly for that. And then I want to finish showing you some of those things I got from that haul because I just keep stepping over them. Now, I didn't keep all that jewelry out. I had to put some stuff away. Um, she got me a lot of nice things, and she keeps 
bringing me milk glass. But I want to show you this. And this reminded me, I don't know if she's done it yet, but Maggie was going to do a, um, a gypsy book. I probably should move this back a little. I found the clip that works for the phone on here. And I put it somewhere so I would remember. Oh, I don't remember. Look at this. And I kept putting it back and taking it down. And so it's it's like a robe. I mean, I could even wear it. So, can you see it? Yeah, pretty. I got this at um, Goodwill. $9.99. But I just couldn't help it for all those pretty beads, flowers. Okay, then. Um, Sheila gave me this herself. She said she must have bought it three years ago at an estate sale, and it's vintage, but she's never worn it or done anything with it, so let's see if I can show you. Can you just picture the ladies walking down the chamber with the gas light or candle light or whatever? And look at these pockets. And I guess when you get cold, then you can pull them down further. There's one spot on it. There's the collar. And it's as beautiful. You can tell this is the kind of thing that needed starched and ironed and wet. Like we used to do roll up. I was really good at ironing men's shirts. I used to go to my girlfriend's and she had brothers. And they loved it because I used to iron all the shirts and starch them and everything. Um, and that's what I was taught. Of course, my kids probably can't iron. They never ironed anything. I did teach the one, but um, yeah, they rolled them up in balls. For those of you that don't know, they starched them, roll, wet them, rolled them on balls and put them in a big plastic bag. And then whenever you felt like ironing a shirt, you did. Well, I, my mother taught me, and I think I said this before, you know, which side of the collar first, then the other part of the collar, then this part, then this part, then the sleeves, then this part. You know, I knew exactly what I was supposed to do, so I was so proud of ironing those shirts. Don't ask me why. I was just a teenager. Might have had something to do with my girlfriend's brother. I kind of had a crush on him. So look at that. Is that gorgeous? And it is truly vintage. You can just tell by these sleeves. And when I see it, I picture a TV program with people, with the ladies, you know, um, probably the ones that work there, walking down the halls with their candles and um, some, a nightcap on their head. <laughs> You know, maybe that's not how you picture it, but I did. So she gave this to me because she thought I would like it. And I think I told you she's the one that I'm making. She won't ever take anything for finding, other than I pay her for what she buys. But she will not ever take anything for gas or, or finding these things for me. She loves to do it, but still. And I got this long doily scarf I did get more like three big ones but I've already cut up those flowers <clears throat> this she got I just don't have the heart to tell her if I don't need anything else so sometimes I'll just give them what, give it away, or it's nothing she gets as expensive. And she's alone, and she just loves to do it. Let me see, where in the heck is the front of this thing? 
purple, purple, purple. Okay. Actually, I could wear this. I forget sometimes. I see some of these things and I think, hmm, I could wear them. Isn't that pretty? The lace sleeves, the lace, the lace, the lace on the bottom, the lace in the middle. Isn't that pretty? I think I could wear that. Then there were a bunch of these burlap, they look like napkins. I think I've given a few away. Then I always get a lot of these white linens. I have tons of them. And this one, that produce kind of, it's, it's almost like it's got um, silk in it. And this is a dresser scarf. It's funny, I talk to people in Ohio, and it depends where you're at. You know, here you don't see people in Florida with dresser scarves and stuff, but I've always still liked them. You know, I go from having them to taking them down. Now look at this. This was the curtain top. Isn't this beautiful? It's a nylon. It's a nylon, yeah. And it's got those. I can't see, but. <laughs> but I think that is lovely. And this, I already took off of something that she gave me. Look at this. Now, Shell, since I didn't remember to give you some of that other... Um, if you would like some of this, I can give you some. And it's got the fringe. Yeah, it was on a dress or a skirt or something. But isn't that beautiful? I just love that stuff. Then, wait to see these. This is absolutely gorgeous. Now, I don't know if she got it or I got it. I don't remember. But... Whoever got it, I'm glad we did. Look at this. It's a curtain, I think. Maybe I should sit back for that. And I'll fall off, as usual. Okay, this is like the bottom. This is the middle. All across. I used a little piece of it yesterday. Oh, for the pocket. And this is the second part that goes all the way down. Is that gorgeous? And that's not, that's not all because there's another one. I'm pretty sure she got it. She said, I just thought maybe you'd like this. And I'm like, oh my gosh. Is that beautiful? It's a whole set of curtains. I probably could have used them somewhere. Because I like this stuff. And then again, in the middle. And then again, this. This. See? That's why I got the pocket from and um, shall tell me if that would work then look at this I don't know if I ever showed you this it's for a big table I might might have done it in my 
that little vignette thing I did. Isn't that beautiful? It's good for a big round table. And look at this. I love this. Now, it's not a pillow insert or anything, but look at the beautiful. It's for a table. And the sides. I'm showing you the right way. And then these. These in the middle. It's like a square middle. And then this. Isn't that beautiful? I might put it on one of my tables. It reminds me of, um, I don't usually buy material, but Holly Lobby was having a, a sale. And some I saw the other. Uh, a few months ago, I liked, but I wasn't going to pay that kind of money for it. And I showed you this. And now I've been seeing these in the store, and I'm thinking, why did I cut that arm off? I could have worn this. But I just love that material. Okay. And I don't believe I showed you this. I already gave someone a little piece. On the right side? Probably not. Is that gorgeous? It was a big tablecloth. It's like silk running through it. Isn't that beautiful? Then I cut this off of something, you know, it was a dress or something. It was the that hard tool or whatever it is you call it. Those under wedding dresses. Let me see. Then I showed you a piece of this last time. And this is about what I have left. I figured I needed to keep a little. <laughs> I try to share some. And what I still have the the bra part. Not pretty. And this. I've shared half of this with somebody. It's just a big um, lilac piece. It was double this. And this is folded in half. Isn't that beautiful? Probably give away more stuff than I keep. And then this was in there. Scarf for breast cancer. Um, I got this. This is, I have had this, but this is a really kind of a thick vinyl kind of material, but yet it's not like vinyl, so I don't know what you call it. This would really be good for, you know, books and whatever else we make that I haven't. Let me see. I think I showed you these. I'd gotten a few of these. And I keep getting these, and I'm, I'm, I'm thinking I'm going to make a, some kind of book out of these. Now, I don't know what they are, if they were maybe priest vestments or for the couch or chair. I don't know, but you don't know how many of these I have that I keep getting somehow. Let me see what else. 
Well, I did get a lot of doilies, but I've kind of put them away. Um, I think I showed you this base that she got me. Isn't that pretty? And I showed you the blue one. And she got me another lamp. Um, like I said, I, I set something down. I did find the part, I told you, to my camera to use with my phone. And I thought I'll put it right here so that it doesn't get, so I'll know where it's at. Um, okay, I'm, what I want to show you too is Diana Bacchus. Um, she just did her first video, so maybe you could go over to her channel. I don't know. She has an Android, and I'm not, she'll learn as she goes along, but her the number for her link is right on the on her so um anyway if you look up diana and then b-a-u-k-u-s you should see her first video and you should comment because give her some encouragement she has worked like heck for the past month with everybody trying to help her and she wasn't going to even do it she was going to give up but look at the pretty flowers she made me see i don't know how to make simple flowers i just keep going and going and pretty soon i have like a a topper for something isn't that pretty isn't that a pretty color I showed some the other day too. Yeah, I end up with these humongous things like that box top I made. I mean, I just keep going. Maybe that's my forte. I don't know. I don't think I have a forte. Um, like I said, a lot of the things that I know I put away um, but I do want to, um, I figure them out, I'll show you. Um, and she's coming today. She said she got some doilies and she got some, do oh, a couple pieces of milk glass. Okay, let's do the drawing. Now, I wrote everybody's name down on each video. So if you commented on four videos, you have four in here. If you commented on one, you have one in here. And I hope you all think it's fair. It's just a little random gift. And I think I, sh I don't even remember, but on vintage, um, on Ooh La La Vintage Treasures and on my Facebook channel, I put a lot of um, doilies and things that I had dyed, and and then I sent them to the person who guessed what I dyed them with. And I don't know if I told you, one was um, I just used red Gatorade. One I used blue Gatorade. Here she probably can't tell. I probably showed you. This is like a purplish one. I used blueberries with water in the blender because I keep them frozen. Um, blue, and then Kool-Aid. And I think I said there was a girl that did Kool-Aid. One did watermelon. She took watermelon and uh, the juice from it. But so when someone does that, I get all like, I have to find something that, you know, I can do different. So, I um, got the blueberries. I keep them in the freezer from Costco and just take, take a handful and put them in my cereal if I have cereal because it's supposed to be really good for you. And so I took a big handful 
I put them in hot water for a few minutes in a cup. I dumped the whole thing in my blender. I added water and I just pureed it. And then, you know, um, I used a sieve, but if I think if you use cheesecloth, it's much faster. And I got that tip from Margaret. And I also got a lot of tips when Maggie White did um, her tutorials on her doily books. There were some things, I mean, even if you never made a doily book, there are some things that give you ideas on how to do. I remember a while back I asked, I think it was her, how do you get, if you have something on and you glued it, how, I can't get it off. Well... I guess everybody else knows this but me, but she said just put your heat gun on it for a minute and it makes the glue loose and you pull it off. Well, that's been a lifesaver for me. And I also learned not to glue things on until you're sure. Like maybe put a little in the middle. And that's what I did with this. I put a little in the middle so that I could put the lace and stuff in between. See, I'm always just so anxious. I'm gluing everything, and then that's when I have the problem. So I learned that. But there are lots of tips that I learned from everybody. Um, but here's the box with everything in it. You trust me, I put everybody's in here yesterday. I didn't want to wait any longer, because I haven't done that many videos, but... I appreciate the people that have um, oh, here's a pink one I did I think that was with the Gatorade I keep going from thing to thing I know is that what people with ADD do and that's a purplish one I meant to bring the stack up I did yesterday and you know I had this big stack of all the colors there was someone I was going to send them to. Do you know for the life of me, I looked all over this whole house. I mean, I even looked in the refrigerator, the freezer, the washer, the dryer, because I tend to go too fast and set things down. But like I said, I had a funny feeling that I, in the box that I sent my aunt in Ohio, that's in the nursing home. And she's not one that is doing, you know, that great. My other aunt is pretty with it. She's going to wonder why in the heck I sent them. Oh, I'm going to show you this too. I found the other day. I know I'm all over the place. And I found a whole bag of blue nods. I thought I'd put it on. But I hate to paint, so I don't think I want to paint. And here, one more thing if I can grab it. This is a mailbox. This is an old mailbox. I don't know how old it is. People probably still have the same box. And you know, they put the mail in there. The thing is, I have to figure out what I did with the key so I could get stuff out. You know, I could paint it or do something with it. Anything cool? I think I have more things now than I have room to put. thing. Now this is really cool. I don't know what it's for. But somebody um, it, it doesn't have a pool thing. I don't know if it's for a bottle. But isn't it neat? It's just a a bag that was crocheted. I have to figure out something cool to do with it. And I got a lot of flowers that she got me. Um, uh, that I can take apart. And that's, that's usually where I get a lot of my flowers from. I'll go to um, some of the other uh, Goodwills that have a lot of more odd stuff and those dusty old vases of flowers they have 
if I like them, I buy them, I take them outside, I rinse them off. And I mean, I've got had the most beautiful like buds and flowers and um, uh, everything. And I had some here, but then I think I gave them away. Okay, I'll shut up, do the drawing. She'll be here before we know it. The mini scrapper, Michelle. I have a feeling she won one of my other giveaways, but I can't remember for what. So we'll have to tell her. She won, we don't know what, but she won something. So. Like I said, every once in a while I'll do a random drawing just to show my appreciation for your watching and commenting. And um, the tape queen, I call her Wormy, Shell, isn't feeling real well and so she hasn't been on here for a while and I asked her what's wrong and she's having some serious issues so if any of you know her or I like to just say hi. Um, you know, you could send her a card if you want to. But I'm sure she'd love to just hear from people saying, you know, they're thinking of her. And it's the tape queen. And as soon as I heard tape, I thought of, wor you know, the tapeworm. So I started calling her a wormy. So, <laughs> you know me. I always have to be different. Okay, guys, I'll think of more things, and I'll show you what else you got me, and um, I just wanted to show you that before I gave it away. Oh, well, we have to part with things eventually, right? Um, I guess it was a good idea when I bought whatever it was I bought that had this basket thing on it, and I think I remember showing you. And so I bought it and then took the 